Some tenants and property owners at the Trade Fair Centre are furious following a midnight demolition of their structures. The exercise was conducted under armed police protection in spite of a court injunction. A disagreement between some tenants and the Ghana Trade Fair Company since government announced a redevelopment plan about three years ago. The issue resulted in legal tussle leading to the tenant securing an injunction on the redevelopment. The last injunction was reportedly served on the trade fair company on Friday, February 14, after attempts to overturn the earlier court's order. According to the affected tenants and property owners, the exercise was conducted without any notice. They alleged the bulldozer demolished selected properties at different locations within the trade fair center, raising suspicion of having been targeted. It was one harassment after the other. So we decided that we we're going to go to court. So we went to court and we got an injunction on the trade fair. Last Wednesday, they went to court to remove the injunction. And our lawyer immediately filed an appeal and a stay of execution and served them. Then Sunday night, with all those things pending, they decided to come here and come and destroy the factory completely. There are procedures legally to follow, to come and do a thing like this. This is not, excuse my language, tomatoes we are selling here. Other affected tenants were equally at a loss at treatment meted out to them. They said they are coming to redevelop the place. We are not against it. We were just asking them to give us a compensation so that we can also go and uh, continue what we are doing. And we've been in court since. It's about three years now. So they, they demolished the first phase. And then they came back again and actually entered all the rooms, the, the shops, the factory, the production room, the packaging, and start smashing finished product, raw materials, machines, and everything. And it's, it's very pathetic that, I mean, we cannot build a country like this. Some affected property owners were recovering some of their items. We are surprised at what is happening because if anything, why don't you do it in the morning? You should, you should, you should have done it in the morning and not midnight. Attempts to get a reaction from the trade fair company were unsuccessful. The news team was told to book an appointment to speak to the chief executive officer or any director.